the most dangerous animal body parts that can kill them. Different species use their body parts in different ways to see, hear, grasp, protect themselves, move from place to place, and search, find, and take food, water, and air to survive. However, the question is, how do animals use their body parts to help themselves survive when, in fact, some animals have not realized that it will inevitably cause their own death? For today's video, Animals Wow TV has put together the ultimate list of animals that seem to kill themselves with their own body parts. But before we go any further, do you want to win a PlayStation 5? Just like and subscribe to our channel and leave a comment down below and also don't forget to press the bell icon to get new excellent updates only us can provide. Alright, without further intervention on this list, here's the most dangerous animal body parts that can kill themselves. Sheep's unending grown wool on its skin. Talking about a close shave, some people say that the shearing sheep is cruel. On the contrary, it is cruel to the majority of modern sheep not to shear them. Domestic sheep do not, of course, shed their winter coats. If one year of wool is not eliminated by shearing, the growth of the next year simply adds to it, resulting in sheep overheating in the summer. They have dramatically diminished mobility and are in much greater danger of flight, both of which cause misery and potential death. A sheep named Chris had a much-needed shear that possibly saved his life. Shear is a merino sheep, a special breed of sheep renowned for providing some of the softest, finest wool in the world, and they never quit doing that. That's where Chris got into trouble. He was lost in the wild years ago and his wool never stopped rising. And when the shearers actually removed it, they gathered a record-breaking 89 pounds worth of fluffy things. Including on the list, the Argali sheep's majestic spiral horns. Have you ever heard of the Argali sheep? Argali sheep is also known as the sheep of the mountains and is the world's largest sheep. They can also grow up to 1 meter in height and weigh hundreds of kilograms. However, despite their magnificent beauty, this sheep has a tragic fate to deal with. Imagine that the horn is just starting to dig into its face, and it has to keep rising. It looks like he's being held hostage. It's not rare for us to have a ram whose horn curves into their eyes like this. The magnificent spiral horns of the Argali sheep can both defend and destroy them. The horns of Argali are corkscrew-shaped, and the male Argali sheep typically use their horns to compete with each other. However, rather than being a possible weapon for the sheep, their horns can also cause fatal injury to themselves. If you take a closer look at their horns, as the sheep gets older and the horns get larger, the horn will be able to pierce their cheeks. Do you know that there is a pig with a piercing fangs? Exactly, you heard it right. There's a Barbarossa that belongs to the family of pigs that has piercing fangs that might kill themselves when it's grown. Barbarossas can get impaled by their own teeth. They have the most sought-after objects. Did the overgrown of the tooth destroy the animal? This wild pig has fangs that could pierce its own skull, and the canines of a male Barbarossa are an evolutionary mystery. They never stop developing. They are too delicate to hunt or forage, and given time, they end up twisting and penetrating the skull of an animal. In fact, Barbarossa is definitely one of the most remarkable animals in the world. It is present only on remote, forested islands where it has grown in isolation. It also has a lot of mystery about its life history and habits. And it's got the fangs called tusks, the unreal tusks. No other animal has something like it. The two upper canines penetrate through the skin of the snout and curl back to the forehead, gradually expanding back into the skull, killing the unfortunate Barbarous. The Donkey's Hooves The donkey is a beautiful animal, but since most people don't know anything about it, they are often likely to suffer from health problems, with the most common being untrimmed hooves. The hooves should be short and upright with an oval bottom. If the toe is long and slanted, it should be trimmed. Most donkeys will need a foot trim every 6 to 10 weeks, but caution should be taken with older donkeys who may be struggling to lift their limbs. You should try to keep your limbs as low as possible during trimming. If the donkey's foot is overgrown, you can obtain a radiography before trimming to check for any changes to the bone within the hooves. The vet should also be consulted on pain relief. Buck's Incredible Antlers 
If you've ever wondered where the reindeer's forces come from, look no further than the towering crowns of the bone. When the antlers grow, they are wrapped in a fuzzy skin and fur sheath called a velvet. It is packed with special nerves and carries blood and nutrients to help create the bones it protects. How cool is that? However, they also used their antlers on a fight with another buck. It was a fight of death for these two big bucks after their own antlers were stuck together. They get trapped, they fight to exhaustion, and then die. Including all the damage that was likely caused by an intense battle involving three white-tailed bucks powered by testosterone, these rut-crazed bruisers were locked together in a death match that ended in a horrific drowning party. That's indeed a horrible ending on this buck's life with their own body parts. Alright, how are you finding these most dangerous animal body parts so far? Comment your thoughts down below. Keep on watching because they're bound to be the slowest animals that you might not believe as the body parts and characteristics that eventually can do harm for themselves. Tortoise Shell Depending on your point of view, this is one of life's great questions. How's the tortoise that flipped on its back stand up again? It's not a rhetorical question, it goes beyond a metaphorical or a philosophical question or a topic for drunken debate. It's an extremely serious matter for a tortoise. Being able to correct itself counts as one of life's epic challenges, a potential matter of life and death. Armored animals can quickly lose their balance and collapse on their backs where they are vulnerable to exposure, malnutrition, and predation. That's why it's much more risky than getting a deep tank. If they're trapped upside down in a puddle and can't keep their nose above the water, they're going to drown if nobody's there to save them. It's partly common sense that animals won't grow broad head adornments if they live in dense foliage. One wrong move and the animal may become entangled in such a way that they starve to death without help. Lastly, Sloth the Slowest Animal Take a look at the slowest animal in the world, so sedentary that the algae settle on its fuzzy hair. The plant gives it a greenish tint that is useful for camouflage in the trees of its Central and South African rainforest home. Both sloths are built in the treetops for life. They spend almost all their time high hanging from branches and strong grip, supported by their long claws. Sloths also sleep in the forest and they sleep a lot, about 15 to 20 hours a day. Even when they are awake, they always remain motionless. On ground, the frail hind legs of the sloths are powerless and their long claws are a hindrance. They must dig into the ground with their forehead claws and use their sturdy forehead legs to pull themselves along, dragging their bellies across the earth. If trapped on ground, these animals have no chance of escaping predators including when they hanged around the trees. Like this video? Please share your thoughts on the comments down below. And before we end this video, please don't forget to hit that like button below and click subscribe to our channel, Animal Wow TV, for more amazing and related videos. Thank you so much for watching and stay tuned as the next video is starting.